before it's too late. Low. Maybe one of his men knows where he's headed. This is Captain James Gordon with the GCPD. This is an emergency situation. And I am assuming command. Security personnel and GCPD officers, turn your radios to channel 13 for further instructions. These are black masks, men. I'll make them tell me where I can find Black Mask.
That area of the floor is weak. I can use my explosive gel to break through. They say crime doesn't matter. Someone ought to check the good police commissioner's pockets. Because they are lying. What have I got to show huh? My own man in the slammer? No, I know more. No, tonight, we're making some changes. Some big changes. You're a dead man walking, love! come through for you? You may have, Gillian, but uh, things have changed. We're starting with a clean slate, and you're not on it. What are you talking about? I'm not on it? After all, I'm done with you. Police coming here, Show's over, boys. Too late. Commissioner Loeb is dead. Black Mask has a lot to answer for. It's the back! We're never getting out of here!
it better be. Or the next thing that gets smashed will be your face! <laughs> Memory card is damaged, but I should be able to recover most of the data back at the Bat Cave.
such thing as a bat. Are you back for the night, sir? Huh? Mm -hmm. Shall I warm up Christmas dinner? No. It's going to be a long night, Alfred. I just ran into a human-shaped crocodile who told me Black Mask has hired assassins to kill me. Assassins, sir. As in more than one. That's right. And you heard this from the mouth of a crocodile, man. His name is Killer Croc. He's already behind bars. Oh, I pity his cellmate. I don't. Let's see what else is on the drone's hard drive. Each of them gets one of these envelopes. I need them delivered tonight. They're all hired killers. The best in the business. Black Mask isn't messing around. Slade Wilson, Deathstroke. Former military, subject of a failed medical experiment. Failed, you say? Garfield Lenz, a.k.a. Firefly, burns on 90% of his body. His obsession is going to be his end. How unlike anyone I know. Here's a face I don't recognize. Copperhead. Strange. These reports reference a male, not a female. Fourteen escapes, huh? Well, you won't forget now. What the... Floyd Lawton, a.k.a. Deadshot, Freeze! says here he's an expert sharpshooter. How on earth? Suspected of many assassinations. Dangerous, but reckless. Street tough named Lester Baczynski. Calls himself Electrocutioner. Shocking. Shiva. Her skill is unmatched. Is that Warden Joseph? Must be how Black Mask got inside the prison. He uses torture for intimidation and entertainment. Eight assassins after your head. What are you going to do? I'm going to find out who is operating this drone. Make them tell me what they know. Then I'm going to find Black Mask and put an end to this. Sir, I may be stating the obvious here, but you do realize that since you and I are the only people who know the Batman's true identity, those assassins will all fail their mandate if you just spend the evening here. They'll put innocents in danger to attract my attention. I can't take that risk. And you think it's a better idea to just put yourself in their crosshairs? There's only one person in Gotham who can get his hands on something like this. The Penguin. He's been tracking Black Mask. Its next waypoint was a rendezvous with Penguin's men at Jezebel Plaza. I'll make them talk. Sure, this is wise, sir. I know what I'm doing. Well, in case you change your mind and want to train tonight instead, I'll keep your training facility active.
So, to make your travels easier, I went ahead and set up some auto-nav points at different areas of the city. One of my preset destinations should take you right to Jezebel Plaza. shot and probably the hostage too but they won't expect an attack from above nobody ever does out there with you? Crazy? We were answering the service call. That's it? you better not be lying who's out there Take her by crawling through the vent. What the hell is that? You think it's the guy that hired us? You piss him off or something? Get yourself to safety and call the police. They'll want to see what's going on here. Okay, I will. This was just supposed to be a I can fix the tower. Whatever you want. Just please don't hurt me. All I want is for you to get yourself to safety. Function is from storm damage. I need to set up a crime scene and find out what happened. I should start by identifying the victim. The victim's name is David Shannon, a Gotham Optics employee sent here to repair a faulty network tower. But what killed him? Scanning the DNA impact on the wall should provide an answer. analysis indicates the victim was killed by some kind of explosion originating at that access panel. I should scan it for additional clues. It looks like the panel was rigged to detonate when swiped with a key card. Someone really didn't want this tower repaired, and it looks like that same someone left a set of fingerprints behind. Alfred, I'm uploading some prints for analysis. Let me know what comes back. Certainly, sir. Searching now. And here we are. They belong to one John F. Baker. He's a rather unremarkable criminal. Small jobs, mostly. And... Uh, hmm. That's curious. 
What's curious? Mr. Baker's dead, sir. His body was recovered from the Diamond District just under an hour ago. Looks like someone's tying up loose ends. I can bypass the booby-trapped access panel with my cryptographic sequencer, but I'll need the encryption codes from the victim's access card. Reviewing the crime scene will show me where it is. This card has the codes I need to hack any of the network tower's access panels. Alfred, contact the GCPD. Let them know about the body. Send the data from my analysis, too. Certainly, sir. Does this mean you found the source of the disturbance? I think so. Well, well, if it isn't the King Thug himself. Figured it was only a matter of time before you showed up. Sorry about the mess downstairs. Who is this? Think of me as a great big mystery, one you're never going to solve. Enigma, then. Oh, you must think you're so clever. Well, how's this for clever? I've taken control of towers all over the city. As long as they're active, your bat wing's useless. And it looks like it's gonna stay that way. I mean, this one's practically begging to be taken offline, and you still can't hack it. Pun intended, of course. Hmm, Black Mask's not going to like this. What are you talking about? Wouldn't you like to know? With the jammer offline, I can travel here with the Batwing. Those relays are part of a distributed security system. I wonder what they're protecting. That must be where Enigma set up shop. I need to pay him a visit. I see you've regained control of the Batwing, sir. I suppose it's off to Jezebel Plaza, then. That's the plan. Then I've also got a lead on Enigma. Well, don't overthink it too much, sir. We both know you'll eventually wind up doing both. Jezebel Plaza before that arms deal. I'll have no way to locate the penguin.
Looks like the crime in progress the GCPD dispatcher just mentioned. I could go investigate, perhaps stop the crime. But I also need to get to the arms deal at Jezebel Plaza. here. I need to find a spot where I can stake this place out unnoticed. Penguin. Not a dime changes hands in this city he can't tell you about. If anyone knows where Black Mask and his assassins are, it's him. But Penguin's hard to find. His men are doing a deal here. I'll make them talk. Guys. <laughs> so... Little boys, what do you want for Christmas? Oh wait, I already know. Now let's see if you've been naughty or oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Thank you. 
Where's the penguin? I don't know. Where is he? I swear. Damn. Wake up. What happened? <laughs> Time to talk. Where's Cobblepot? Let me go! If you insist. Please, stop! Stop! I'll go! I'll take anything you want to know! Please! Too late. I already have what I need. No! If I can read this SIM card, I may be able to locate Penguin. Alfred, I'm getting interference on my comm systems. Is that on your side? No, sir. I'm seeing it as well. It's from the nearby GCR tower. It's the same signal jamming the Batwing's auto nerve systems. I've highlighted the tower on your map. I'll need to stop that signal before I can track down the Penguin. Never seen this guy or heard his Congratulations are in order. Maybe you're not as stupid as I've been led to believe. Why are you doing this, Enigma? Direct. I like it. So, I'll tell you. Gotham Sully. It's filled with brutes who control this city through violence and intimidation. You didn't answer my question. Because you didn't let me finish! <clears throat> I want to get rid of them, Batman, to improve Gotham's intellectual and moral standing. But I'm not a thug like you. My approach is a bit more... refined. What you're doing is no different than stealing. There's nothing refined about it. <laughs> Your response is as predictable as it is banal. Goodbye. Now I can access the SIM card I took from that arms dealer and hack Penguin's communications. Way out of the city. Alfred, I'm reading a signal from Penguin's men, but it's not associated with any known wireless frequency. Ah, yes, I see it here. Looks like Penguin runs his own private wireless network using laptop transmitters serving as ad hoc comm stations. He's feeding his men frequency. Is 
this via two-way radio. There are two of these comm stations near your position. Good. Mark them on my map. If I can find any of those walkie-talkies, I can triangulate Penguin's position. Station. Then I'll be able to triangulate Penguin's position. Then mess with our shipment, like saving his own arms. So next time you want to make up a story, you better hope the person you're telling it to is dumber than you are. Oh, wait. That's right. There ain't no one dumber than you! Mr. Cobblepot, I swear it was the bat. He dropped Ricky off the roof of the clock tower straight into the Christmas tree. I don't care what you think you saw. If you're not back here with my money in the next ten minutes, I'll cut your damn eyeballs out. And then you won't have to worry about seeing them ever again. Thank you, Mayor. Yes, Mr. Cobblepot. I'm sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. An encrypted data drive. Looks like it's part of a larger set. If I can collect enough of these, I should be able to read the file.
inside the comm station. Then, all of a sudden, on the coldest night of the year, we got to stand guard. It's some passive-aggressive form of punishment. Hey, the reason we're out here is because all the assassins in town. Assassins? At the Penguin? What are you doing? Oh, after the bat. Black mask kind of. But Penguin's worried they might track him down and something like that. Whatever these relays are protecting, it can't be good. I should destroy any more I come across. Listen up. I know I ought to cancel our annual boiler deck fights after what happened tonight at Jezebel Plaza. But just there to show you, you a nice I'm guy, the, final offer. the fights are still on. So get yourself down to the ship right now if you want in on this. Penguin's been hiding out on an old ship. No wonder he's been so hard to find. Wait for laggers. silently to proceed.
Batman? Looks like someone brought a bat to a knife fight. Watch my blade!
on now. I've seen schoolgirls with more grit. All right, lads. The rest of you losers to me are going to have to embarrass yourselves without me. God knows you can do it. I've got some business to take care of in the office, and I don't want to be disturbed. Trace it to the spots till I get back. Sounds like Penguin will be in his office. Tracy should know where that is. I'll make her talk.
someone as paranoid as Black Mask wouldn't trust a loudmouth like him with any secrets. If I want to find Zionis, I need to find Penguin first. the signal, I'll be able to track him down. I'll get to work on that. Where are you off to now? I'm on my way to the final offer's casino. I'm going to make Penguin's assistant show me to her boss.
Gino. Penguin's assistant must be nearby. I'll make her tell me where I can find Cobblepot's office. enough she can tell me what to do. Yeah, you're right. You can't let him get the upper hand. That's what my dad always said. Of course, Mom would slap him right after. <laughs> well, sure. Let's kill this son of a bitch! Shark, you 
and I might welcome you. And you know what we do to trick us? Oh, well, you're a bad guy now, don't you? Why?
You suggested little Alberto over here. Hey, baby. Try to convince his father to take early retirement. He disagreed and called you a, let's see, psychotic little bastard. No, 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 please! <laughs> 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 Oh, you best listen, Falcone. Because this is the last time I'll ask. What are you going to tell your father? That we're getting out of the weapons business. I promise. I'll make him do it. <laughs> I'll see your lips flapping, Bernie. But they ain't making the sound I want to hear. Uh oh. 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 Did you 
do not spot the opening I gave you. Help you help. I am stronger, faster. You'll regret that. Know that you die with honor, which is more than can be said for most.